Welcome back to part three of the greenhouse build for the monkey tail skinks. I just came back from Lowe's at 39 degrees. We got our gravel for the sides. Big old bag of peat moss. Um, some play sand in the shed. And now we're gonna do a little, we're gonna do a, a border of gravel around. And then we're gonna mix our peat moss and our play sand. And then the rest will be like repti soil and jungle mix and whatever else I decide to mix in there to help the plants grow and give a nice bedding of moisture for humidity. And yeah, so let's go do that. As you can see, the gravel is lined all the way around. Now we're gonna cut the peat moss open. Roscoe's over here trying to help. Hello. What do you need? <laughs> Hello, my fish. Well, yeah. We're gonna get this done. Go get the place in. Get that all mixed in. Do not lock me in here, please. That would suck. Good job. Good boy. All right, let's work. And the peat moss is in. Covered up the gravel. Also covered up my pants. Yeah! Then I'm gonna go get the place in. And then go eat some breakfast. Cause I'm hungry. Oh, it's gonna look so sick. And I have a little treetop hide right here. And maybe another one right near. Yeah, it's gonna be sick. I love this lock. Can't wait to get that uh that master lock that locks in so ain't no one gonna be able to get in y'all. That's the big thing for me. But yeah. Let's go get the play sand. Mixed in the play sand. And then the next step would be all the other previous monkey tail skink substrate from like the iguanariums. But the only one that I have to use is the one that's out there. I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know how far I'm stretching. But. So I'm gonna do that, get other soils, and then start adding plants. Also I have to get black silicone and end off these little caps so that they're not sharp so nothing gets hurt. But I do it to every single one. And then after that, all that will be secured. I think I still am gonna go get board to sandwich these on top, or at least this one and that one just cause they kind of stick up a little bit and I don't want anyone to escape. Um, besides that, yeah. So I'll see you guys. Well, you'll see me in the next clip, but this will probably be a couple of days. But yeah, see you in a second. So before I left for work, I added some of the soil, some of the plants. Can you not? Can you go somewhere else for a second? No, 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 no. Really? But, so we're gonna add some more soil. The reason I didn't add the bottom part of this soil is because there was like a colony of ants. And I don't want to really add a whole colony of ants into my monkey tail enclosure. So we gotta get some more other soils. But honestly, it looks pretty good so far. I like it. But yeah, okay. Now you guys are definitely seeing me in a different clip. So a little update from the last clip you guys saw. I screwed in, as you can see, screwed in some pieces of wood. Use some of the silicone to snap back on some pieces, which I think I still should end up sandwiching boards between the 
ends of the uh, chicken wire and the wood. So I'll probably end up doing that after I get paid tomorrow. Um, yeah. So all I have to do is basically button up all the little chicken wire ends, build a tree house right about there little stand whatnot i'll probably put the water bowl roughly about here just so it's easier access for me to change it out and everything and then so gotta put the wood sandwich pieces there and besides the sandwiching the water bowl and the hide and the heat and everything like that oh i just need to add more soil some plants some bromeliad, some more pothos that are going to be a little bit more lively. Because these are the aftermath of Eve eating all of the plants. So hopefully when I get some more pothos and some more plants, it'll all take flight, grow in very heavily. And yeah. So I'll pick this back up when uh, I do the next step, next move kind of thing. Yeah. And leaf litter was put down. And then topsoil was added on top. And then last but not least, oh, actually it looks so good in here now. I got some hibiscus in here. I got a whole bunch of pothos, bromeliads, <clears throat> a ficus, some snake plants. Yeah, a bunch of branches. Got a part four, obviously, is going to be building the treehouse for the monkey tails. But if you guys can see, there's isopods. Yay. I need to collect a lot more, but yeah. It's going pretty good. But the last thing I got to do, which I'm probably going to do today, is get those two boards that are going to sandwich this and sandwich that so nothing's sticking up, nothing's popping out. Nobody can get out. And that's going to be the last little bit. And then probably off camera, I'll just uh, get pieces to kind of sandwich between the inside panels. Like certain ones are smooth enough to where they're not going to hurt themselves. But there's other ones I'm still going to probably end up sandwiching. Like ones over there, over here, and over here. But yeah. Go get those boards. Sandwich them, and then that'll be the end of part fresh. Lock it all up. Take everything back out. Yeah, see you guys in a second. And everything is done, minus the treehouse for the monkey tails. But I got my sandwich pieces. This is solid. At solid, I can lean on this. I lean forward. I could do so many activities on top of this. No, I'm, I'm not doing any activities on the top of this. But besides the treehouse, one more thing I would want to do: maybe have like a branch that reaches from there to there. But I still feel like they have enough room to like literally do whatever they want. But I still do want some like crossbar branches just so they can get from one side to the other instead of crawling across the ground. Unless they prefer it, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed part three. Don't forget to subscribe. Um, subscribe, like, comment, and share. Also, thank you for 100 subscribers. That's the coolest thing one of the coolest things that happened this year um and then december is my birthday month so maybe we'll hit 200 on my birthday but i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see y'all later peace